Okay, 90 seconds off start time here. The Barnacott Plumbing Maiden. Favoritism with the six, Dreamtime Jean. $3 even ahead of the five, want a cracker, three twenty. Bronte's Dream just drifting as we approach start time. Out to $5 now. Elusive Dream at six fifty. dollars uh, Peter Fernie with a handful of well-fancy chances in the first here, but the favourite with Dreamtime Jean. Thanks, Leia, as Tab Radio join us now on course for the first. The Barnacott Plumbing Maiden. Favouritism with Dreamtime Jean as these runners start to link along over at the 1200 metres. Bronte's Dream has gone forward. Bronte's Dream, a $5 chance. Joining the line now, the fave from the Gary Bowen stable. There goes Bad Boy Boo into line as well. Bad Boy Boo locked away. No plastic to come along as well. So just a handful of runners to come forward and we'll be set for the opener here on Anzac Day 2024. Good crowd building on course. Plenty uh, sitting in the sun. Cool conditions in the wind. Perfect conditions for these horses today. So we're just awaiting Dreamtime Gene and also Wanna Cracker. So Wanna Cracker being led up towards the line. And uh, Lady Derringer as well from the Anthony Oram yard to come forward. An 8.50 chance has had a, a little bit of support in the lead up to start time. Was $10 a couple of minutes ago with Tab Touch. So the favourite will be the last. Now into 2.80 Dreamtime, Jean. Austin Galati in the saddle and comes forward. We're set for the Barnacott Plumbing. 1,200 metres ahead. Red lights on. Set to go and the gates fly back. They're off racing. Now want a cracker straight out the back door together with Bad Boy Boo. Bronte's Dream with early speed today goes straight to the front and the favourite Dreamtime Jean working around the outside to sit prominent. Then we had the fave who's there with Lady Derringer and No Plastic trying to find a position. A break of a length then to Elusive Dream with Bad Boy Boo. And at the tail, it's Wanna Cracker. We've got six lengths covering the field of eight as they leave the 800 metres behind them. And as Bronte's Dream held together, shows away a neat length on Dreamtime. Jean, the favourite. The fave sitting third down on the inside. No Plastics had a torrid run. They were followed next of all by Lady Derringer. Then Elusive Dream, Wanna Cracker off the track. And Bad Boy Boo is last of all 400 metres to run. They're approaching the straight now. And it's Bronte's Dream who's showing the way. Asked for now then Dreamtime Jean who's trying to reel in this leader it's off and gone a further two to no plastic wanna cracker the fave Lady Derringer into the clear it's Bronte's Dream with 200 metres to run clear by a length and a half the outside Dreamtime Jean coming at it it's Dreamtime Jean who levels up with Bronte's Dream Dreamtime Jean favourite punters home in the first Dreamtime Jean wins Bronte's Dream second third elusive Dream it is a dream time finish. Fourth in Lady Derringer. They were followed in next of all by Bad Boy Boo. And then we had Lady Derringer, no plastic, followed in by the fave and Wanna Cracker was one of the last. Number six. Dream time, Jean. Hayden Ballantyne. And Austin Galati taking out the first. Start number six today for this lean, mean machine gelding, Dreamtime Gene. Second in was the seven, Bronte's Dream, who looked to drop off this favourite, but when they straightened up and balanced up for the run home, Dreamtime Jean dropped another gear and went on by to win by a clear margin, a length and three quarters in fact, by a length and a quarter between second and third. Numbers six, seven, one, eight will get fourth. Six, seven, one and eight. But we had Bronte's Dream balancing up the best part of two and a half in front of Dreamtime Jean and Elusive Dream from the tail has hit the line with gusto. Lady Derringer 
just one pace but an honest enough run and in that final 100 metres it was the Hayden Ballantyne trained Dreamtime Jean who went on to break maiden status today at start number six. So number six your winner for Hayden Ballantyne and Austin Gallardi by Lean Mean Machine from Tricolor and owned by Mrs A Ballantyne, G Catherall, D Walters, P Wilson, the Harbour Gal Syndicate, Mrs A Pink, J Pilati, D Nan, the Jenga Syndi Syndicate, Twister Arm Syndicate and Know It Ale Syndicate. So a host of connections there involved with the winner. Seven gets second. And that is, of course, Bronte's Dream for Pete Fernie and Lisa Staples by Dream Ahead from Crown Saga. Owned by Inter Philly, Mrs. T to Philly and Sue Stewart. Third in the one, Elusive Dream for Peter Fernie, Tash Faithful, Palantino from Desi's Dream. Owned by Andrew Ingalls and also Pete Fernie. And fourth in was the eight. That's Lady Derringer for Anthony Oram and Christo Sardalic. Numbers there, six, seven, one and eight. A length and three quarters by a length and a quarter. Race two is next. And it is the JB contracting maiden. It's coming up at two minutes to two. And we've got a field of eight and a very short price favourite here. Dublin Red, number eight at 165. Next best in the market, flying the flag at 480. That's race two coming up in 35 minutes' time. In the meantime, interim numbers six, seven, one and eight.